We walk in dominion by faith. 1 John chapter 5, verse 4. For whatever is born of God overcomes the world. And this is the victory that has overcome the world, our faith. So the Apostle John clearly indicates to us how we live as overcomers, how we walk in this overcoming capacity or this capacity for dominion which God has given to us in the person of Jesus Christ. How do we do that? He says this is the victory or this is the means to the victory as one some versions would render it. This is the way we have victory. This is the way we have overcoming power. How? It's by our faith. So as believers, it is so important to understand how to walk in faith and how to exercise faith in our hearts because it is the faith that is in our hearts that enables us to dominate, that enables us to walk in dominion over what is around us. We must exercise our faith. Now faith, of course, is birthed by the Word of God. So we need to know what the Word of God says. We need to know what God has done for us in Christ. We need to know who we are in God and in Christ Jesus. We need to know the, about the completed work of Christ on the cross. Uh, we need to know the power of the blood of Jesus. And we need to know the authority of the name of Jesus that has been given to us. These are these truths from the Word of God will inspire, will cultivate, and will build faith within us. And it is that faith which we use to walk in dominion. If you and I want to walk in dominion, we cannot walk in fear, we cannot walk in belief, we unbelief, we cannot walk in doubt, we've got to walk in faith. When we walk in faith, we can exercise our authority and our dominion over demonic powers, over the works of darkness. We can walk in dominion and authority of the system of evil and rebellion that's in the world that tries to overthrow us, overpower us. We can walk in dominion and authority over the circumstances, the situations uh, that uh, happen around us, and we can exercise the authority God has given to us by faith, by exercising our faith. Now, how do we exercise our faith? Two important things. One. The Bible teaches us that we need to speak our faith. So you speak words of authority. You speak words of dominion. You command, you rebuke, and you bind, you lose to the words of your mouth that you speak and in the name of Jesus Christ. Because it's in that name that we have been given authority. So you must speak words of authority. You must speak words of command into your circumstances, into your situations, to the things that are happening to the works of the devil, to the demonic powers that are active. You speak to them and issue words of command. And secondly, faith is exercised by what we do, by how we act. So we must learn to keep walking and not be a withdraw, not turn back, not flee when we face, when we are confronted with these evil things. But we march forward. We walk boldly in dominion and authority. Action expresses faith. The declarations you make express your faith. And through the words you speak and through what you do, you exercise your faith and you're able to walk in dominion. Remember this. We were created for dominion. God has restored dominion to us in Christ Jesus. He wants us to walk in dominion. And, our, and we walk in dominion, authority, by faith. Do this. Practice this. Walk in this in your everyday life. Let's pray. Father, we thank you for what your word reveals to us. And we ask for the grace to be able to walk in dominion, to be able to walk in faith, and to walk in victory. Help us to bless other people as we walk in our God-given dominion, we pray. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.